guys, this is Yahashua with Simple Keys. Welcome back to another video. Today we're going to learn how to play Do It Again by Elevation Collective or Elevation Worship. This came in as a song request and I thought I would share with you guys how to play this song. It's very, very simple. It's in the key of B flat major, only uses a handful of chords, and only has a few parts. It has an intro, a verse, chorus, and a bridge. And that's it. So only three sections. And um, that makes up the entire song. So yeah, let's get right into it. Okay, so this song is in the key of B flat major. B flats are one, C's are two, D's are three, E flats are four, F's are five, G's are six, A's are seven, and B flat is our one. Okay, now this song really only uses a handful of chords. Uh, the biggest chord we're gonna see is E flat major in a ver in various ways. So we might see like an E flat major, E flat major seven, E flat six. Um, but let's quickly just go over the chords that we're going to need for this. So it's an E flat major chord, which is the fourth tone chord of the B flat. And then we're going to need a B flat major over D. And then we're also going to need a B flat major chord. All right. So that's the third chord we're going to need. Another chord we're going to need is the E flat major over the G. And the F major chord over A. And that's it. And then a B flat major chord. Okay, so the four chords or five chords we're gonna need E flat major chord, uh, B flat over D, then B flat major, and then E flat major over G, and F major over A. Those are all the chords we're gonna need. Okay, so let's now start with the intro. It goes. Okay, so let's quickly go over that. So we're starting with a lead note, which goes, which is the melody, and goes, so that's the melody. So we're just going down the scale, and then and skip that one, okay? And all we're doing in our right hand is playing an octave of that, so it's, and then, okay? So left hand is going, is going to play that E flat major chord we talked about already, so, Okay, so you can play it with just octaves in your left hand and in your right hand you're going to play that first inversion of that E flat major chord and I'm playing an octave here because this is the melody. You can go or you can go with the melody is up here so I'm playing this one. If you're a beginner and you feel this is too much of a stretch you can just play that E flat major chord. So you can go can go you can also play that or you can just play the B flat major chord so B flat major chord over D and then back to the E flat major chord okay and then to the to the B flat major chord or you can go all right so that's it this is the intro gonna play just a little fast so we can kind of go to the next stage one, two, one, two. okay all right and this chord over here is a B flat sus 2 so you can actually substitute maybe a B flat major chord here to a B flat sus 2 just to kind of give it a more open clearer feel okay so next part is the verse now this is where we use um, E flat major 7 walking around these walls and then B flat major chord over D. And then we're gonna go, which is an E flat six. If you wanna see that it's, this is a seven. Just bring that guy down. And you can play the octave in your left hand and just a G, a G and C. And then a B flat major chord. Okay, E flat major chord, oh, E flat major seven. That's the entire verse, and then we're gonna get into the chorus. Your promise still stands. Great is your faithfulness. 
Okay. It's my confidence. Never feel me yet. And then goes. Okay, let's get into the course again. So E flat major chord over G. F major chord over A. B flat major chord. You don't have to add the melody. Um, I'm just taking the song from a beginner's approach, so we can just keep it simple. So it's an E flat major chord, and then back to the G. Uh, e flat major over G. To the bridge, um, it goes. We can go. Okay, and that's the entire song. So, what what are we doing here? We're playing a B flat major chord over D. What I like to do here is I like to take this B out. So playing the B flat major chord like this, I take this out, and then I just play the F, B flat, and then the F. And I'm gonna go three, three, four, four, three, three, four, four, seven, seven, one, one. Okay. And all I'm gonna do is just shift my thumb and my pinky one note. So because we're moving from the B flat major chord to the to the E flat major chord. But to make the transition smoother because it's pretty fast, we simply go keep your finger in the B flat, just move your thumb and your pinky. And the last one is the F major. Okay. Or you can go F major, B flat major. So whichever one you feel would be easier to make a transition, do that. So if you want to go, you can, or you can go, or you just change one note. So I like to kind of make things simple for myself. So, and then, okay, now when you play the left hand, it's gonna sound like this. Okay, so the bridge is gonna go the entire song alright guys so if you like this go ahead and give it a like comment and subscribe and um, definitely have more content coming your way and uh, if you like more of this stuff, just let me know in the comment section below. And if you guys also want to learn how I how I pick up songs like this uh, in a matter of minutes, you can go ahead and check out simplekeys.com. Um, have some free resources there, and also have some programs that can help you understand how to play music by ear. Really systematizes, so um, it's really dead simple to pick up how to play songs like this. All right, guys, so I'll see you in the next video.